Peaky Blinders has been on, I think, for is now in its last uh, six seasons. I was very interested in this to begin with because it was created by Stephen Knight, uh, who also did Eastern Promises, one of the best modern crime movies out there. Uh, he's done some really interesting things and some things that are less interesting. But the first season of Peaky Blinders was really gripping about uh, gypsy gangsters in Britain after World War I, coming back from World War I, uh, with Cillian Murphy leading the pack. Uh, Helen McCrory was also very good. She died very sadly. Uh, only she was only like 52, very good actress. It's lost its way as it's gotten into, it's now in the 30s, it's now gotten political, uh, it's dealing with the rise of fascism, and it's very confused in its attitudes toward uh, politics. It doesn't quite have a way to go. It all centers on Cillian Murphy's character, uh, and I feel it's lost its way. Maybe it'll get better. It really was that first two seasons uh, that really sang 